Thank you for your comments. And herein lies this problem. None of us know. None of us are smart enough to know the truth. Traditionally, how most people look for a leader is they look through their policies. What they send, but guess what? They never follow through. You must see this, right? And for the average Canadian to research all the policies that these politicians say they will put in place and actually be able to follow up to see whether it's done, very, very unlikely. You do agree, right? And that is why I see a lot of frustration with my post. It's because it seems almost hopeless. I've got several comments telling me not to vote because I don't understand politics. And it's true. And it's also true that traditionally there is no way for us to tell whether a leader actually has integrity and will follow through with what they say they will do correct? But now there is a way and is a very well studied way by the late Dr. David Hawkins. And this method is called a muscle test that can be used by certain people to tell between truth and falsehood. So let me show you an example. The six leaders of the six main parties, I won't list their names, but there's only two that calibrate above integrity. And that is Yves, I want to make sure I say his name right, Yves Francois Blanchet. Phew and Maxime Bernier. Those are the only two of the six main parties that calibrate above integrity. What needs to be done is that we go through each candidate and do the muscle test to see who is integrous. And then you can look into their policies to see which policies are best for Canadians. This is a well-studied method of telling truth from falsehood. And I believe it's something that we must use going forward. Can anyone else familiar with this method help verify my calibrations, please?